Hey everyone, it's Annie with Universal Parks News today. We're at City Walk at the Universal Orlando Resort because the new Universal Studio Store is getting ready to open. Walls came down recently. The plastic on the windows has been removed and now we can see inside the store. The outside doesn't completely look finished, but the inside looks ready. Now, before we go inside and give you guys a tour, <laughs> before we go inside and give you guys a tour, take a little look at some of the window displays here. Now, if you look closer, you'll notice that behind each display, there's like a blueprint for something you'll recognize around the Universal Orlando Resort. We've got plenty of Wizarding World merchandise here. You can see Gringotts here behind this display. So you've got the bank there. You'll see the team members out here are hard at work getting things ready. We can see the team members inside are also ready for the day, getting everything all set up. More Wizarding World merchandise here. As I said, there's team members outside and inside getting ready for the day. You'll see that Universal Studios Florida arch here behind this display. My personal favorite is the Islands of Adventure Lighthouse. <laughs> they're ready, they're excited. They can't wait to show it off. I think this is probably my favorite because you can actually purchase this blueprint inside the Williams of Hollywood prop shop at Universal Studios Florida. get a little peek in here of course we're gonna go inside and show you everything you can even see a, the screens up there oh it's not time yet <gasps> we've got a display for the Simpsons you can see the blueprint back there is the quickie mart On this side, you'll see a display for the Minions. And you'll see the blueprint for Despicable Me, Minion Mayhem, right there in the background. Behind the Marvel display is The Amazing Adventures of Spider-Man. You get close there, you can see Spider-Man over the entrance. And not a blueprint, but definitely something blue. We've got a Velocicoaster coaster display. There's actually three of them. So definitely building up the hype for the new Jurassic World Velocicoaster. coaster. At this entrance, you'll even find Universal in gold lettering here. And of course, more Velocicoaster displays. What could go wrong? And now that we've shown you the outside, we'll get ready to show you the inside. The old Universal Studios store has now turned into the Universal Legacy store. If you haven't checked that out, be sure to check that video out on our YouTube channel. It's filled with props photos, all sorts of retro things. So make sure you check that out if you haven't seen it yet. And of course, we'll show you what's going on in the new Universal Studio store. We 
we were the first official guests inside the new Universal Studios store this morning. It did not take long for word to get out. And you can see there are a lot of people already shopping around. Tons of great merchandise, even new merchandise. As you look around the store, you'll see more of those blueprints above each display. Everything's organized. If you're looking for something special, this is the place to go. We've got teas. They're $25 each or two for 40. A lot of new ones we haven't seen and some of our old favorites. That's probably my favorite. Everything kind of seems to have its own section. You'll find Marvel all grouped together, Jurassic World and Jurassic Park items all grouped together. We've got Velocicoaster displays. There's a huge section for the Wizarding World as well. And lots of new merchandise. And I'll show you some of that merchandise here in the video, but you'll have to go to universalparksnewstoday.com to get more photos and prices for everything. They've got a parcel pickup area. So you can have packages sent here, pick them up. Tons of accessories, keychains, pins, everything you could want, bags. Of course, plenty of face masks. Now in the very center of the store, oh look, good timing. They've got footage of the Velocicoaster playing. They've got point of view footage, as well as some other shots here. We'll show you those in just a moment, another angle of those. It is exciting to see that Velocicoaster footage playing, but there's also other great attractions, uh, hotels, Volcano Bay, everything you could want. So it's kind of fun. It's a very long loop. So if you're in the store, take a moment to watch. It's pretty cool. Now in the very center of the store, we have a cashier, obviously. And as you're waiting to check out, there's all sorts of little items here. We got pencils, we've got candy. We got uh, reusable bags, wand bags, more face masks.
They've got a candy section. There is tons of great new Universal candy. It's incredible. If you have a favorite character, there's definitely going to be something for you. There are three entrances to the store. One is on the corner right across from Cowfish. One is in the center. And then another one on the end closer to Voodoo Donut. All your retro merchandise in one location here. Love the artwork. see that big screen right above the cashier or at least right when you walk in the building here from that main center entrance personally one of my favorite details is that they have a fitting room I know that might not seem like much but I've often bought two shirts just because I wasn't sure what size I needed and so I took them home tried them on so this will save you a little bit of time here so you can try on things. And the Wizarding World section is huge, as you can see. Love the lighting from the ceiling. And here's just some of that new merchandise I mentioned and the blueprint of Hogwarts. Now some of this merchandise isn't even available in the parks yet. So this is kind of a first look at that. Everybody is excited over this new merchandise, as you can see. We have tons of great glassware, dishes. If Hogwarts is your home, you can now make your home look like Hogwarts. We've got several different quotes from Dumbledore available in pillows and wall art. mugs, coasters. Again, we're going to have more photos and pricing on the website. So head over to universalparksnewstoday.com for more information on all these items. This is just a quick look for you guys. I see you next week. Such great quotes that they've chosen. Now, don't forget that if you purchase a $250 or more Universal gift card, you get a free non-interactive wand. So if you're planning on purchasing some of these items, it might be beneficial to get the merchandise card so you can get that wand. And here is probably my personal favorite stuff, all the dishes. There's bowls, there's plates, glasses, cups, everything you could want something for every house so you know if you're a uh, Slytherin like me got plenty of things they've also got oh you can see the bowls that have a little bit of everything on it so they've got all the houses on these and the Hogwarts crest so whether you want a specific house or you just want something for Hogwarts Plenty of things. I believe these are uh, stemless wine glasses.
drinking glasses. Again, you can get one for your specific house or just Hogwarts in general. Coasters, glasses, even salt and pepper shakers. Really loving this line of merchandise. Got the plates, serving dishes. Got Ravenclaw and Hufflepuff on this side. And Gryffindor and Slytherin were on the other side. There's also new athletic wear for all the houses. So we've got some jackets, we've got some leggings. Really stylish. Got hoods. Represent your house. The leggings are great. They've got all the houses on the bottom and then they've got the stripes on the side. All the colors for each house. So those can match with anything you want here. If you've got whichever house jacket you get or even the tops, you can see there's tops as well. This is also where they have moved that uh, Harry Potter press penny machine. So this used to be in the old Universal Studios store. Now it is located over here. The old location is the Legacy store, as I mentioned earlier. Really love these jackets. You can see they've got all your gear here. So if you are Gryffindor, Slytherin, Ravenclaw, or Hufflepuff, they're divided into sections. Stop in, pick up your robe. And you can even get a wand here. Love this area of the store, it's beautiful. They have the wands displayed on racks and they are each labeled. So you know exactly whose wand you're looking at. You can see they uh, spin. And this is just beautiful back here. Oh, and if you look up at the ceiling, see, I didn't even notice that earlier. Why are you going to be so difficult, kid? He's saying he doesn't want to go with the box, so I'm going to start saying So if you're stopping by City Walk, make sure you guys check out the new Universal Studios store that is now open. Lots of details, lots of great merchandise. Now we want to know what you guys think of the new store, so make sure you leave a comment. Of course, subscribe to Universal Parks News today. Hit the bell for notifications so you don't miss any videos from us. And we'll see you next time.